And we are underway. It's a low line drive kick, and it's going to be taken uh, by Ben Rogers at the goal line. Rogers up over the 20-yard uh, line. He'll get to about the 23, and uh, that's where the uh, Big Red will open up uh, this uh, football game at the 23-yard line. Sombord on third down, fires, and this one's complete inside Tiger territory all the way down to the 35-yard uh, line. And that's uh, Chris Lenz. He's the first two intended receivers. Neither are on our board. <laughs> so they're going deep into the, uh, the roster. And this one's incomplete at the uh, 44. And uh, that time, uh, that's uh, Trevor Osborne who comes in. Uh, that would have been his 16th or 17th catch with a long of 57. Somborn swings near side all alone at the 50-yard line. And the big tight end rumbles down inside the 35-yard line. That's Matt Sullivan with his 13th catch of the year. He always see if this hurry-up offense gets in the gear right now. I got him, I got him. Get off looking near side, swings it out in the flats, and a good open field tackle. But the uh, completion goes up to the 25-yard uh, line. This is a third and nine for Knopf and company. Blitz is coming. Highest percentage of blitzes. Knopf steps up, and he's going down. That is only the ninth sack for the big red here in the fall of 2015. And that brings up another punting situation. This time Roth uh, punting from uh, just inside his 10, and this one's blocked. And it's going out of bounds around the 35-yard line. So, again, the Big Red with even better field position than last time. And Bob Serace must be wondering, what's going on here, guys? Let's get things going. Working out of the I formation again. Soundboard. Down the middle, has it inside the 10-yard line. Just shy of that pylon. Again, the big tight end of Matt Sullivan. And that's his second catch already here this afternoon. Yeah, Sombor that time on the play. Actually, nice job of getting away from the center. Take a look at the fake here at Hagee. Watch the linebacker step up. Now quarterback sets his feet, able to make that weight shift. Nice touch on the football. And the big tight end rumbling, stumbling down the field. Matt Sullivan, I'll tell you what, 89 wants to be the player of the game. He's doing it right now. <laughs> Get off. Comes back the other way, and this is going to be six. Boy, he really sold that one looking right, and he came back left to the tight end of Scott Carpenter, who gets his third touchdown. A third and five here. Bring the blitz. And this is Hagee. Hagee inside Tiger territory, finally inside the 40-yard line. And he's brought down by Chris Smith as they try to snap a two-game skid. Radigan, and he's got some running room, and he's still on his feet. Joe Radigan up over the 40, dropped inside the 35-yard line. Would not be stopped. Falling left guard that time, and right tackle, great. Play action, Knopf looking and firing, has his man inside the five-yard line. Tigers threatening again. Trips to the near side. They come near side and they swing it out. It's complete. And inside the 40-yard line is Marshall Deutz with the second catch of the day. Yeah, Chris Lentz, nice job in the open field of throwing that body out and making that block. And that's what allowed that play on that bubble screen to continue. Be to the near side for Somborn. Somborn steps up, fires, and has it. Rogers and knows there's a touchdown. A late indication before the arms came up, but Ben Rogers just spun and just got over the goal line for his third receiving touchdown here this fall. How about throwing a laser? Sambo standing in the pocket that time. Again, feels pressure from Burke Olsen, and then he finds 18 Ben Rogers just running the post. Take a look at it. Again, how about Ben Rogers? Talk about athleticism, stop the mid stride, spin around back, extend the arms, and go snag the pigskin out of the air. Somborn opens up, and this is Hagee. Hagee has some running room. Nice lane, and Hagee's off to the races. That is what we were talking about. And a Smith comes up. Hagee in the backfield. Comes the blitz. Somborn rolls. Has his man inside the 15-yard line. That'll be a first down for Cornell. Wound up missing a field goal after getting pushed back out of the I formation. Haggy breaks to the go. outside. 
Hagee wins the race, dives inside the pylon, and Luke Hagee gets the touchdown for Cornell. Breaking through very quickly is number 10, J.J. Fives. So third down and goal. Lovett's uh, bound to determine to get another touchdown, and he now takes the lead in the Ivy League. That's his 10th uh, touchdown. Somborn. Hagee, Hagee breaks, and over the 35, 40, to about the 42. So Hagee will have his 8th uh, 100-yard game. And the kickoff is going to be taken at the 5 again by Rodgers. Rodgers has had a workout today. Rodgers uh, right up the middle, has a lane, and Rodgers over the midfield strike and inside the 40-yard line of Princeton. A beautiful return by the senior Ben Rodgers out of Geneva, Illinois. Yeah. So it's second down now for the Big Red. Trips to the left. Quarterback rolls out to that side. Sombor. Voids the rush. Hagee. A little sidestep. Hagee inside the 10. Inside the 5. Hagee all the way down to the one-yard line. Powerful run by Hagee. I'll tell you what. Does he make people miss? Once he catches the ball in the open field, that's what I'm saying. He could be a receiver. Look at this quarterback on the check down. Now just people whiffing. 25 is just going to continue the dance here, and then he's going to say, well, you're going to bring your buddies, and I'm just going to roll you over almost into the end zone for touchdown. This time, Somborn out of the gun, wants to throw, fires, and he has his man for a touchdown. It's Lentz. Chris Lentz, the senior. Zainovich's kick. Low line drive. It's going to be Nelson uh, three yards deep. He's going to take it out. Dre Nelson over the 15-yard line, and Nelson over the 25-30. Nelson cuts back, 40, Nelson inside the 40, Dre Nelson is going to take it to the house, touchdown Princeton, a 100 yard kickoff return by Dre Nelson, his second touchdown of the afternoon. Doing the right thing and penalties when you have many of them. Wow, nice hands uh, by Galatly. And Galatly listed as a fullback. They said next year you'll get a shot to play some tailback after rushing for 93 yards last week. Galatly averaging 7.8 yards a carry last week in Hagee's absence. Somborn has a man open at the 25. And again, it's number 18, Ben Rogers. Had a nice afternoon. What are his catches on this afternoon? 47 to 21. Uh, so uh, Princeton goes to 5 and 2, 2 and 2 at Penn next week. Cornell 0 and 7. 0-4 at Dartmouth on Friday night for Richard.